Hello everyone, Michael C. here with a Competitive Rifle Podcast. I've been away for a while back and I was just about to start a video about different types of match bullets for the 223. And last week, or the week before, uh, while checking back in, I got an email that Geisley, or has uh, read from the AR-15 podcast as uh, Gazelle, was having a special on blemished parts. And I got one of their blemished parts, supposedly, in uh, 2012, their Mark III uppers, the ones that, uh, four ends as I was, the ones that they were making for the Marines, and I have yet to find a blemish on it. So... By the time I was able to get to a secure server and a website uh, to uh, order these parts, most of them were already gone. Luckily for me, the Mark 7s, which are the DCM approved national match forearm, were still on the site. So I was able to get one. I got it in a desert. It just arrived in the mail. So I thought I'd share with you, whoop, open in this thing up. Drum roll, please. And remember, we're using sharp tools here, so watch your fingers, wear your safety goggles. Uh, ah, look at what we got in here. We have a nice Geisley hat, some swag, which uh, <laughs> I think I cut <laughs> with the knife because it was sitting right here on the edge, so you shared that moment with me. Uh, we, of course, have our wonderful Geisley instructions that come with it. What I've always liked about Geisley is their instructions are clean and easy and straight to the point. Oh, we've got a Geisley swag kit here. Some uh, patches, uh, God and Country, a little thing, whatever that's, four zippers, and bumper stickers. Probably put those on my vehicle or cases. Uh, receipt. This was a great deal. You've got to look out for them. It was 50% off. What I like about Geisley's too is they come with all the tools you are going to need. Recently I put together a upper from another manufacturer and I had to go out and buy a $20 tool to install it. And the only thing I'm ever going to need that tool for was for that installation. So, now let's open this up. Geisley packages their parts very, very well. And now so you don't cut the upper, oh, here we go. Open that up. Wow. Look at this. So this is the Geisley. DCM approved. If it's approved by the DCM, it will be approved by the NRA also. For competition, this is their Mark 7 upper. Uh, Bill Geisley made a very nice video about this upper. Anything better than I could do. So let's look at it here. Let's see, can I find any blemishes anywhere? Uh, Let's see what we're looking. Hey, there's some, some tool marks on the bottom here, but I would expect that anyway. I would not consider I would not consider that a blemish. And I do have one of my friends on our team that uh, got one of these and just absolutely loves it. Well, my friends, if there is a blemish here, Geisley has some very, very high standards, which that goes without saying that we know that Geisley has very, very high standards. I've gotten other blemished parts before where you could see gouge marks or numbers weren't set in correctly or like the Picatinny rail might not have been cut properly. I am not seeing anything on this forearm that would lead me to believe that it is a blemished upper. I said the only thing, as I said, the only thing I could say is tool marks, and for that curve right there, 
I would I would kind of expect that. Uh, perhaps uh, the unblemished ones don't. They buff them out. I'll get with uh, my friend who's got one and look at his. So what I'm going to be doing with this is I'm going to be building another upper to add to my collection of uppers. I'm going to be using a new specialized uh, front side post that I just found that a company makes and I'll probably throw another white oak arms one and seven in there throw this thing on a uh, billet upper I've got to check with DCM see if billet uppers are actually authorized or not and we'll take it from there again supposedly this was a blemished upper they were 50% off uh, anything that you buy from Geisley is going to be high quality whether you buy it at a discount or full price in fact I think everything I bought from Geisley except for the one mark three forearm and this I've paid full price for and it was well worth the money all right well now let me get to work on the next video we'll be doing which is going to be about match 223 bullets so go build your uppers and go shoot have fun